What's up guys, Ross Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to restore, how to roll back or how to run a backup into our WordPress website. Imagine the following scenario, you did made a website backup following the video tutorial that I'm gonna leave a link in the description below and a card over here. And you did made your website backup. Something goes wrong while some theme or plugin update, you broke some content that is important for your site, and you would like to restore your site from this backup. How to do this using Updraft Plus free WordPress plugin is what you're gonna learn in this video. But before I can continue, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button, like this video, and share this content for a friend of yours. After this, go to our WordPress dashboard, make sure that you have Updraft Plus plugin installed on our site. If you don't have, go to plugins, hit the submenu, add new plugin, review the upper right corner of our screen. Next to search plugins, we're gonna type Updraft Plus and you're gonna be installing this guy right here and after you're gonna click into activate. After, and right after you do this, review the left side bar of menus, hover a mouse over Updraft Plus. And right here, you should be able, even if you run a backup and deleted the plugin, you should be able to see the existing backups. The plugin gonna create this into a directory on your server, and they always gonna be here, independently if you deleted the plugin previously or not, okay? And all we have to do into this backup, existing backups, we have one from yesterday, that we made for another tutorial and we have all the files we can click on restore okay and choose the components to restore we can restore plugins themes uploads others and database you can restore all basically okay go to next downloading back file no problem at all just click on restore There is an activity log, so you can follow the process and see it happening. First, they're gonna be verifying the contents, the files, if everything is okay. Normally, the process can change according to the amount of content you have and the amount of page, plugins, themes, files, media, okay? Nothing to worry. All the process can be done very fast. As you can see, I did not cut the video. Restore successful. Return to updrafts configuration. Now my website it's loading the content from yesterday. Okay? Simple, easy and effective. Yesterday I did delete this backup right here. So now I have it back. Simple, right? Another good way, in the case that you don't see nothing right here, it's load the file that you just have downloaded, as I show into the previous video. Click right here into upload backup files. Then you're gonna click on select files. And you're gonna need to select the files that you would like to upload, okay? For example, just like this. This is one of my backup files. I'm gonna click on open. It's all complete. Now I can see this backup right here. And I can restore from this point, okay? Simple, easy, and effective, okay? In the case that you have any question, feel free to use the comment section below. And I see you tomorrow. All the best.